Jim Dillard. Mariel Heights. Brianne Dory. Kyune Sugohara. Defiant diplomat, Jewish savior. September 1st, 1939. May well be regarded as a turning point in modern history. For on that day, the largest war mankind has ever known commenced with Germany's invasion of Poland. So began a war that would soon ensnare countries for nearly five years and cause nearly 30 million deaths. One story of tragedy and shame woven within the fabric of World War II was the plight of the European Jews. Tragic because over six million innocent Jews lost their lives. Shameful because one man's obsession with power and superiority led to the persecution and murder of so many. Shameful too because sovereign nations, including the United States, facilitated this persecution with restrictive immigration quotas and a desire to stay neutral. However, during this time of despair, there surfaced a little known story of hope, of goodness, of human kindness, from a Japanese diplomat named Shimune Sugihara, who would soon become a candle in the darkness to thousands of East European Jews. <laughs> Great news! 
transit visas. In the meantime, we must be patient. Remember, our lives are in his hands. For now, let us be hopeful. What are we going to do to you, Nate? This third telegram is like the others. Listen. Concerning transit visas requested previously, stop. Advise, absolutely not to be issued to any traveler, not holding firm and visa with guaranteed departure from Japan, stop. No exceptions, stop. No further inquiries expected, stop. I know you will do what is right. It is as you said last evening. If you do this, you will be disobeying our government. But if you don't, you will be disobeying God. Our own government has forgotten the wisdom found in the ancient samurai proverb. Even the hunter cannot kill a bird which comes to 